At Leighton Contractors, it's time for us to think about ways we can be stronger together as a group and how each business can learn from the others. This means thinking less as individual areas and projects and more as part of one team. Metlabs was formed in 1950 and is Australia's first private commercially owned non-destructive testing business. And that's industrial radiography, ultrasonics, uh, condition monitoring for our clients. I found by working in a partnering way, we both understand what our businesses want to achieve individually, but also collectively. And that way we're much more aligned in the outcomes we're achieving. I'm achieving my goals and I think Vision should be achieving their goals in this way. I'm looking really forward to the future. There are challenges, but the, uh, the opportunities are great as well. Mayfield Engineering provides a range of engineering services and solutions for clients across Australia. Mayfield was established in 1936 and um, really over the years has grown into a multidiscipline engineering company. Um, we take on the whole project from civil, structural, mechanical, electrical and deliver the whole project to the client. The legacy of Spencer Street Station will be a wonderful landmark in a city where landmarks are important. Spencer Street is a demonstration of the can-do culture of Leighton. We have hung in here and completed this project. The relationships we've amongst built with all the partners in the Port of Brisbane. While urban environments provide many challenges for construction companies, large mining projects come with their own inherent environmental sensitivities on a much larger scale. Clients are looking for a mining partner that can uh, help in key areas such as the environment, uh, community and not forgetting safety. Uh, that's not doing a good job. At Leighton, we are looking more and more for opportunities to partner with businesses up and down the value chain. This includes financiers, developers, major suppliers, consultants and specialist subcontractors. In terms of the M7 project, a very large project on the, uh, on the outskirts of Sydney, Leighton's and Macquarie decided very early on that we were going to work together on this project. Did a lot of initial work, actually put together a consortium and we worked together as a, as a great team with Leighton's. Leighton's also brought in the Abbey Group who were very good in terms of uh, paving and, and making the uh, making the project work. Roads before we've got a big heavy uh, public interface. The community have had a, a huge role on this project. They've provided some very yeah, positive com feedback. The company and usually for everyone else concerned, uh, the budget always holds. Uh, we fulfilled our commitment to all the stakeholders, the, the public, government agencies and, and our clients, uh, the private funders and it's at the end of the day it's been a, a good outcome for everyone involved in the project. From a base in Perth, focusing on high quality short term projects, Broad Construction Services now operates in South Australia, New South Wales and Queensland. Broad is a construction company, it's in its 15th year. How they can build it for less price and share the savings. Having a latent contract as a, a major shareholder will provide While security. success for both Broad and all latent group companies is important, it can't be achieved at any cost. The safety and health of everyone in the workplace is our first priority. Safety is imperative because uh, the environment that we're in, um, the machinery we use, the equipment we use is possibly life threatening. Report it to somebody who can stop the work or rectify the problem. While forging stronger partnerships with our clients is the way of the future, it's important to remember that strong internal partnerships are needed as well. How well we support each other across our many businesses and geographies will determine just how strong we will grow. It's really important that we do work stronger together. The reason being for that is unfortunately the business has operated uh, in silos. We need to remove those barriers and we need to look at it as a national company. We need to be able to leverage off what are the best practices we have in the business. And uh, integrating them into our, in the rest of the uh, infrastructure. We're looking for people to have a career with the lanes as opposed to a job. Uh, we need to sustain our staff to develop them to ensure that they have a career in place across our uh, lanes. in it, knowing that they've built the job together. We had a great team uh, who, who lived the vision of, of creating a new business and I think that that energy and passion came out in a, in a, in a better than expected performance. Without that passion, we wouldn't have been able to achieve what we, what we, what we ultimately did. When we work with, with, with latent contractors on, on a project, 
We have to work as, as one team. We are stronger together for the sake of the bid and for the project delivery and ultimately for the community who's receiving the benefit of the project.